<laughs> More cheese all the time. It is National Cheese Day today, so. I mean, like, not on the YouTube, maybe, winky face. I'll just upload this, <laughs> like, later on. Oh my goodness, no. Nah. Okay. What's wrong, Milda? Uh, did something happen? Darling. Oh my god. Darling, darling, darling. I missed you so, honey, much. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Darling, I missed you so. So this is... Believe it. <laughs> Darling, I miss those bulging muscles of yours. So when I was away, I could hardly, hardly sleep none. I missed you too, Milda. Without you napping next to me, I couldn't hardly read a line. But the night will finally be able to have a nice dinner together. Together? T -t together? Wait, you don't mean... Where are my manners? Y'all forgive me. No, it's been so long, I just... Allow me to introduce you. This is one of the three wise men. My honey but sweetheart, darling. Darling, these are new friends. Justin, Fina, and uh, that other boy. Uh, howdy, y'all. Uh, thank you for taking care of my Melda. Welcome uh, to Lane and our home. A uh, talking bull. Believe it. It is National Cheese Day, to be fair. Well, then, I reckon uh, y'all are the ones who stopped the Tower of Doom. I speak for all the folks in saying, like, we're in your debt. Justin, Fina, and, uh, the Kafu boy. Don't mention it! Uh, we, we handle, uh, cat, uh, we handle cats like that all the time. No problem. Believe it! We've been trying to find out what was petrifying things, but we didn't know the tower had a terrifying monster. Gaia, what is that thing? You and that Gaido, uh, feller, uh, said y'all last uh, seen people in forests turned to stone. Ain't that right? Then that might just have something to do with uh, why the ancient Angelou uh, disappeared from the land. Why, Don, these youngins are uh, on a journey to search for the ancient civilization of Angelou. Hmm. Before uh, we talk about Angelou, something I've been meaning to ask. What's that stone you have there? This? It's called the Spirit Stone. It's a keepsake from my father. I knew it. Uh, the mythical Spirit Stone. It really does exist. I own everything, uh, everything to it. My meaning with uh, Liet, the quest for Alet. And look, I have the key too. What? That medal! It's the key! To the legendary shrine of Angelo. The medal of wisdom. But it was never found! How can it be? It was Alet uh, who uh, told me uh, to get take this and come to Alet. Alet, let <laughs> I never would have thought it. The spirit stone. Letty, the Medal of Wisdom. Well, it's plain to see that y'all are the chosen ones to go to Angelo. The chosen ones to go to Angelo? Me? Seems like it's our duty as the three wise men of Elaine to teach you all we know about Angelo. It's the least we could do besides uh, thanking y'all for saving the Kafu Forest. Justin boy, ain't y'all got some questions? Uh... How can I help, help petrify people? We thought we would find the answer once we uh, got to a let. But we could not get to the key to open the door. Only the one worthy of receiving the key from uh, Leti is able to enter. The one who was worthy. That's you, Justin. Boy. You mean I'm the only one who could save all those petrified people? Justin, boy. What's Guy have to do with Angelo? The ancient Angelo, uh... Of prosper thanks to a great power, but we, they were destroyed by the same power. I believe that it was the power that weren't meant for no human beings. A great power? Is that Gaia? Hmm, I believe this is a matter uh, best answered by Old Master uh, Derlin. He's the expert of Angelo uh, history. I see, then let's go and talk to this uh, Derlin guy. And then, who are the Arcurians? 
We saw a Kirian and Kafu, a girl named, uh, Lean. Now just wait a minute, Justin boy. What did you say? Did you say a Kirian? So it's true. When the power of the Spirit Stone gathers in one, there shall an Arcarian be born. I seen another one. Lati, two Arcarians, Lean and Liette. But just what is an Arcarian? Now hold on there, Justin boy. Liette ain't no Arcarian. Why she's the priestess of the Shrine of Alette. Like, I had no idea. Oh boy, this has been some help to y'all. Darling, you said that I'm the only one who could go to Alette? But how could that be? How do I get there? Tell me, tell me, darling! Oh my darling Clementine! Uh, freaking... Oh my darling, oh my darling, oh my darling Clementine, you were lost and gone forever, oh my darling Clementine. Uh, there's no cow in it, but, like... Isn't that what that's the pun of? Whatever. Ace makes waste, uh, Justin boy. The time will come. You'll be able to go to Olet. Because you're the chosen one. Uh, ain't you a bear with uh, athlete's food? Uh, calm down, boy. Uh, darling knows what he's talking about. I suppose you're right. Sorry, darling. Milda, thanks. There's plenty to learn before you find the way to Olet. Rest yourself here, spell boy. Uh, talk to the other two wise men. He could have the house ne uh, near the gate. Suppose y'all want to see Darylin first. Uh, he's the wise man that knows about the wisdom of Angelo. Alright, let's go, boy. We're going to see a lot of each other. Like it or not. Aw. It's so cute. But there ain't no reason to hurry. Just like y'all uh, spat, uh, gotta chew your food. Y'all gotta have time to think. Justin, y'all ought to listen to uh, Durlin down yonder before you head over for a let. Now, Durlin lives two doors down due west of here. It's the house with the axe leaning on it. Can't miss it. He's also got plenty of youngins whooping and harling about, around about. So those these act things in town, uh, those act things in this town are called uh, raps. Okay. Oh my god. Oh, she has like a little cute thing. She really loves her darling. Oh, that's so that's that's cute. The heck? Is Milda a furry? Oh my god. She's a bloody furry. Oh my god. I can't believe this. I just don't believe it. All right then. So let's talk to Derlin. But let's let's talk to them. Hopefully something gets cleared up. I do plan to do at least one other dungeon. Right there's old Derlin's place. Uh, two doors down to the west. Y'all see an axe standing there? There's youngest playing in front. Can't miss it. She really does just repeat. Let's see here. Well, look at Milda's uh, friends she just brought. Uh, that, they're just kids. You hear that, Justin? Kids! Some nerve. Well, don't y'all uh, see we expected adults to look big like. Uh, take Darlin, for instance. Aww. Summer's coming soon, so we uh, can swim, pick flowers. It's a short season, and I love it. Men can study all winter and not get bored. But for us uh, women folk, uh, summer's the most fun. For me, I don't care if I'm inside or out, as long as I can see with my darling. Also, all the women are, are like like super like like buff and and Vara and all the men are just like all oh, astute. It's about time to sow the seeds of uh, summer famine. We have to ask darling where to sow. Hold on, there's still snow on the ground. Isn't it a little too soon? Hmm, it's almost summer, boy. Ah, summer's our short, so we can have we have to grow when we can. Oh wow. Look at what I did. I cut all this wood all by myself. Mama said she was so proud of me. She said there was enough for all next winter. I'll bet I'm the only one who could do get a job done so fast. What are these people saying? Why, Madam Vilda, uh, how long has it been? I trust you as well? Why, 
D-line, I lose the mat a bit, uh, pot boy. What has gone into you three today? Lena is about to come of age, uh, so we had decided to play as much as we can while we can. Okay. Why, uh, Linda? Uh, what's what's wrong? You look like a a mo a mo guy a merchant in bankruptcy court. What happened? Um um, something's wrong with my brother. I uh, learned her. Uh, he talks funny and stuff. I know I came of age and all that, but I never seen this before. Okay. Long time no see, Milda. Where, uh, where were you? Out somewhere? Why, it's Sterling's boy, I learned in. Are y'all talking funny, boy? Why, you come of age, ain't you? Indeed, I have my horns that come in, and by the grace of the spirits, I'll be of age shortly. Okay, then. Let's go to, let's go to Derlin's house. This would be, uh, been a good time for a second minigame. Eh, yeah, I kinda would've. Mix it a little extra of sulfur, a uh, root of Leave leaf of Lulu, and to top it off, oh, hello there. <laughs> your humming's a daring, uh, sight better, uh, your research, Darlin. Oh, uh, what's that, uh, uh, botonics? Botonicals? Uh, these are medi medical herbs. I just can't get enough of this research of Angelou. Who are the youngins, villain? Milda? Now, where are my manners? Let me introduce my friends, uh, Justin, Fina, and, uh, uh, the boy from the Tower of Doom incident. Nice to meet ya. Say, we've heard that you are an expert in Angelunian, uh, history, and what you'd like. Say no more, Justin boy, I've heard all about y'all, uh, from that, that Mungai, uh, uh, merchant fella. So, we're, like, famous? Wait, a Mungai? Gaido, for chance? That's true, the situation in Kafu is very similar to the ending of Angelou civilization. So then, it was the Gaia's power that destroyed Angelou as well? I think you hit the nail on the head. But even if it was Gaia, what's with all this people petr petrification anyway? You know that just because Angelou disappeared, a normal drop in the number of spirits has seen was seen. In other words, we think this drop in the number of spirits was the cause of the petrification. Wait, could it be? Then that Gaius grows by absorbing the spirits? That's a clever observation. If you look at it this way, things start to make sense. Then is, is there a way to return petrified people to normal? Well, if petrification is caused by loss of spirit, then restoring the spirit should return them to normal. Hmm. The words of yours say how to return the spirit. You mean it's all written somewhere? But the page is thrown. I can't read it. What? Hey, you pulling a fast one? We're eating roast beef tonight, buddy. I sit me down there, boy. No one's saying there ain't a way. Maybe if you went to Alette or... So we do need to go to Alette, but the problem is we don't know how to get there. Old uh, Dorlin's the one who knows about how to get to Alet. The problem is, well, it can't hurt for you to just go and see him anyway. You might get something out of him. All right then, let's go, Darlin. Uh, thank you all for your help. All right, cool. So now we need to go, Dorlin. Justin's uh, into uh, medical herbs too. Oh my goodness. Jeez Louise. Oh, Dorlin's got it real bad. But that let gal, uh, y'all talk about, uh, y'all think that uh, may have, uh, he'd have more sense. Problem is, ain't sure if he could uh, tell you uh, much just now. But you never can tell. Uh, Dorland's Tower is southeast of the banks of the lake. Okay. So he lives in a tower area? Milda, if I ain't never going back to the lower village, and then uh, petrified folks ain't come back. Well, Darlin wanted to find out if that's the case, so if he sent me to the Tower of Doom, I guess. So the same thing as having the aliens, but they don't understand it either? Figures. Let's see here, what else? Is this the tower area? Hey y'all from Kafu, ain't you? Uh, what do you want here? What are you all up to? I think I heard something. Nah, can't be. 
It's a woman, and I never listen to women. Just what y'all mean by that? I never heard such a talk in my life. Didn't your mama teach you right? Guess she didn't. Guess she's just as bad as y'all. Y'all, I could tell I can. Jeez. It's pretty messed up, lady. I mean, like, in context. But he's kind of a jerk anyway. My mind never seen anyone from Kafu in the village of Lane before. Maybe it's first. So you want to throw me or so out of something? Well, now, why would I want to throw such a mere thing to a mere child? Oh, Master Thalin. Well, oh, sits all like a, a pump on a log. Once in a while, he'll sigh something about a let or, or a lette and mumble on them to himself. I don't understand anything he says, but he sure gets worked up about that let gal. Okay. Play it, I guess. You know, uh, Wart Orbs in Black from Sonic Rush is the same melody as the, the lane music. Really? I kind of remember hearing something like this before. Alright, I guess we should go talk to him. Master Dolan, my friends here I want want to tell wants you to tell him about how to get to Let. Oh Let, the bastards of the wisdom of uh, Angelo, the place of uh, shrine of the Icarians. That's it. If you know the way, it might help the youngins find a cure for all them petrified folks. I was told to come to a let you see, by well, by a letty. Wow, by a letty. Certainly it was letty. You you must tell me all about her. Were her eyes brown or green? Or were they blue? Uh, uh, oh, letty, beautiful letty. Wait, letty. What? 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 So you are Mistress Letty. You look exactly as I pictured you. Exactly. Wait, no, wait. I'm Justin. This is Fina and, and Rap. Anyway, we, we wanted to get to Alette. Yes, go, young ones, from the Rainbow Spring to Alette. Go to meet the beauteous, uh, pitiedious uh, Letty. Now I remember about Letty. What? That. Uh, do you know something? I remember I... Uh, who are you? Where am I again? What's he talking? What's he talking about? This geezer's had it! Milda, are you sure this guy's alright? Well, something is wrong. He's been like this ever since he left his horn in the lower village. His horn? You're right! No horn! So no horn, no information? That's about the size of it. I wish a wise man's horns uh, hold his knowledge, right, Master Darling? Diddly dee, diddly do, a mistress Letty. Hey, mm. come, Master Dolan. Don't fall asleep with your eyes open. Look, we're not getting anywhere. Uh, getting anywhere, lower village or not, we have to go get this Jesus horn. All right. That boy's right. Uh, won't do no good to just sit around here. All right then, let's go. All right, cool. We'll go. We go. Let's see how this will. So lower. Where do we have to go exactly? The lower village used to be in uh, Lane. Sure was a right good place, but years ago, uh, slumming real bad. Happened and we had to pull out, so we all had moved up to the village we live in now. Now that I think of it, it must have been God that caused it all. So your our village might be in a same the same situation then. Where's the lower village anyway? Just southeast of the village gate. Just go out of the gate and you'll find it. Okay. So we'll do that. And then we'll end the stream as soon as we get all our information together. Quick quick quick. Oh, come on now. Please. Abandoned Liet Village. Oh, it has a rainbow on it! So there is a little rainbow thing. Okay. We've come a long way, baby. Jeez Louise. So I should be able to get this done. I think, I, I think I'll be able to.
What the heck is this? Was this ever a village? Sure was, Justin boy. As big as the one we live in now. Couldn't think of it. It was a lot prettier, too. This is... This is worse. This is worse than the petrified forest. Dallin says here, uh, space is warped and twisted. Monsters live here, too. Let's do it, Melda. Uh, Melda, we have to. You're right, Justin boy, but be careful now. Y'all hear the swarming like creatures. Round and Darlin's house was the furthest from the gate, so we got a long way to go. Okay. So we get save right here too. Go and save right here. This place looks a lot better in the sound version. Okay. What the hell? Is that an illusion? That is weird. You know what this place looks like? It looks like the that one area in Gridia 2 where you have to go into the guy's body. It looks like that. This is to warps phase one. This is weird, man. This is trippy. Okay. Is that fire? Are we fighting actual fire? The actual, actual fire? Fire hounds. Well, I know what that means. I have to use fire on them. And by fire, I mean ice. Pokemon! Advanced battle! No time to question my skills! I know that ice is good against fire! Feel the power of ice! <laughs> Jeez. I could, I, like, when I was younger, I could have sworn in Pokemon. Ice and fire were, like, on equal ground. Like, they both did damage to each other, and they both were, like, weak against each other. But no, it was just ice was weak to fire, and that was it. What a bitch. So, whatever. Hot dog recolors. Yay! Oh, yeah, we did face hot dogs a while ago, huh? Didn't we? And what you recalls? That one girl, Milda, is gonna level up soon. My wife, my wifey. Freaking. So that led us to nowhere. A weird place. This is a really creepy place, and just it's so weird. Was I here already? Ah, oh, dude, it's gotta be one of those confusing mazes, isn't it? It just it has to be that way, doesn't it? To warp space one. Oh, all of them are to warp space one. They're just a different warp space. Well, that's kind of messed up. I don't like that fact or idea. Looks like I'm doing good? Oh, what the f- Did I- Did I do a right thing? Did I get past the majority of this- this- this dungeon? I don't know. Uh, am I- No, I'm in more space too. Okay, good. This is a happy place, with all the scariness. What the f- the frack? Oh god! What the heck? So there's people that are frozen in this area. Oh, whoa. It's like a worse off, like, petrified forest. Like, jeez. Creepy. I'm going the right way. Awesome! I didn't even realize. Oh, and you can see the people trapped inside! That is creepy! That is not correct! That is not cool! Game, please! Whew! I said it's my happy place! <laughs> we'll be getting all kinds of angry. 
This is a scary place. If this is your happy place for me, then you may have some messed up things about you. That's scary. Get rid of that. Please and thank you. And Fina, because you need to get your knife level up. Because I decided to do that. I'll just go and burn. This burn needs to be raised quite a bit. Come on back for more! There's a really cool 90s uh, uh, visual fire effect on the Saturn version. Oh, that seems pretty cool. Oh, my dagger level went up. That's good. And Melda could just beat the crap out of everybody. Yeah! Nice. The fog layer is supposed to swish around like water. Oh, okay. Oh, that's pretty cool, because like, it just looks like a layer. It looks like... You're inside like a body with like veins and things like that. Like it's just kind of like transparent cells. 